வெல்கம் டு கிளிக் மை ப்ராஜெக்ட் டாட் காம் அவர் ப்ராடக்ட் ஐட்டிலிஸ் பவர் சிஸ்டம் ஸ்டெபிலிட்டி அனலைசிஸ் யூசிங் ஃபீட்பேக் கண்ட்ரோல் சிஸ்டம் மாடலிங் இன்க்ளூடிங் ஹெச்விடிசி ட்ரான்ஸ்மிஷன் லிங்க்ஸ் லெட்டர் சி அபவுட் அப்ஸ்டாக் ஆஃப் அவர் ப்ராடக்ட் த மெத்தட் யூசஸ் த ஆவரேஜ் அண்ட் ரூட் மீன் ஸ்கொயர் ஆஃப் த ஹோல்டேஜ் சோர்ஸ் கன்வெர்டர் தட் கன்வெர்டர் கரண்ட் டு எஸ்டிமேட் த கன்வெர்ஷனல் லாசஸ் இன் த கன்வெர்டர்ஸ் சச் எஸ் கண்டக்ஷன் அண்ட் சுவிட்சிங் லாசஸ் த ரிமைனிங் பவர் லாசஸ் the dc dc cable transmission losses due to the i square or the losses in the coupling transformer and ac harmonic filter losses that are evaluated using conventional well known methods in this proposed implementation based on a small signal stability voltage stability and interaction phenomena of power systems with both line commutated converter hvdc that is called as lcc hvdc and voltage source converter kachvi dc that is called vsc kachvi dc are adjusted using the proposed implementation in this implementation the entire power system is modeled as a multi variable feedback control system which consists of three interconnected blocks the contents as well as the inputs and outputs of the blocks are selected such that the conventional analysis tools for power system stability are applicable both in the time and frequency domain in the feedback control system module the relationships between different instabilities are clear and participant agents of each instability can be determined this proposed work is implemented in matlab simling environment next we see about flow diagram of our product in this proposed flow diagram consists of three generating stations and three transformer and nine buses and two hvdc links and three loads and first of all distributor generator is nothing but it provide a real time control of provisional electricity grid and distributed generators generally refers to small scale electric power generation that produce electricity at a site close to consumers or that are tied to an electric distribution system the tg can be used to generate a customer's entire electricity supply for peak saving next one distributed bus this module is used to carrying the electricity from sending end to receiving end uh, a bus path may either be supported on insulator or else insulation may completely surround it power neutral bus paths may also be insulated because it not guarantee that the potential between power neutral and safety grounding is zero and next one is the hvdc link in this current flow diagram is consists two kind of dc link one is voltage source converter hvdc and another one is lcc hvdc first of all we hvdc technology is used for long distance bulk power transmission asynchronous interconnection of two different systems to solve ac transmission problems in hvdc through the controlled action of power electronic devices ac power is converted into dc and then is transmitted to the air record and next one the voltage source converter based bipolar hvdc link is most important applications of hvdc transmission that helps for high voltage long distance transmission under water there are two technologies of hvdc transmission and already told lcc and vsc hvdc next one transformer the transformer is used to changing the voltage levels from uh, generating side and also the receiving side the reason for transforming the voltage to a much higher level is that higher distribution voltage impels low currents for the same power and therefore losses of i square or losses is low along the network grid of cables these higher ac transmission voltages and current can be reduced to a much lower safer and voltage level and the next one is the impedance the impedance is uh, transmission line uniformly is the ratio of the amplitude of voltage and current of a single way propagation along the line and the next one the transmission line conductors uh, this transmission line conductors on the line are generally made up of aluminum through some copper wires next we see about running process of our product in this proposed implementation is done in matlab simling environment in the version of 2013a first to open the matlab window and create a new model file after creating a new model file we are arranging the elements from the simling library browser 
after arranging the elements as per the circuit diagram we click the run symbol after clicking that the output waveform are getting from the corresponding connected scopes the first one is the DC side rectifier output waveform first one is the VDC and next one is the voltage in terms of per unit and next one, uh, next one is the power from the DC side and next one is the bus 5 output waveforms first one real power uh, first one voltage next real and next one reactive power and ABC voltages for bus 1 and next one bus 1 current waveform in terms of per unit and next one is the bus current waveform for various buses connected in the overall circuits and next one is the bus voltage is connected in the overall circuits and next one is the output waveform voltage waveform and current waveform is used to getting the TGST value this is current waveform and next one is the voltage waveform and uh, this is the DC side inverter output and uh, this is also voltage and uh, UDC and next one is the power getting from the DC side in the inverter and next one is the uh, bus 6 is connected in the inverter side output waveforms first one U next one real and next one reactive power that is the reference reactive power is uh, pink color line and another one is yellow color line is uh, output of inverter side bus 6 and next one bus 2 voltage and bus 2 current in the per unit value and uh, next one is the UDC values and uh, next one the filter bus inverter output and next one is the TGST value this is uh, window is used to measure the TGST value for our uh, getting output this is the output current TGST the value is 0.16 percentage this value is very very low value compared to other designs and next one is we go to analyze the TGST value for output voltage so uh, this is V0 the output voltage then click the display the output TGST value will be shown here the value is 0.44 percentage no, this value also is very very low value so overall design efficiency will be increased due to the reduction of TGST thank you for watching this video